Google has a history of slowly rolling out firmware updates to the Android community, but the latest October update that has started to roll out seems to have caused an issue on Pixel 10 devices. So if you have installed some new updates on your device and you've noticed that most, if not all, of your apps are crashing or they're getting stuck at the splash screen, then I can show you a temporary fix to resolve this issue. So at least you can use your phone like you normally would while we all wait for Google to push out a hot fix for this issue. You can see there are reports of multiple people reporting an issue with their Pixel 10 Pro and Pixel 10 Pro XL, and they're noticing apps crashing a short while after launching them. Some of these apps are not fully launching and they're getting stuck at the splash screen. Force closing the apps hasn't helped, clearing the cache for those apps haven't helped, and swiping the apps away from the recents page is set to work for a short while, but then you still end up with that issue of the app crashing a minute or two after you start using it. Thankfully, there has been a temporary fix that has been found, so let's take a look at what you should do. This person on Reddit reports that they were able to resolve this by first installing the Google Play system update for October. And this can be updated by first launching the settings application and then doing a search for system update. Once you do that, you should see an option for the Google Play system update. Tap on here, tap on that entry, and then let the phone manually check to see if you have an update waiting to be installed. If you do, go ahead and install it and then reboot your phone so that the changes can take effect. As the phone boots back up, check out a couple of the apps that you know have been crashing lately and see if they are still having that issue. I say this because again, Google rolls out these updates really slowly, so not everyone will have them available when they check. Now, if that does fix it, then awesome. But if it didn't, and there are some folks who are still having that issue after installing the October update, then your next step is to revert back some of the changes for the Google Play Services application. And we do that by, again, launching the settings, this time we dive into the apps page. We see all of our apps installed. Look for the three dot menu icon at the top so that we can enable the show system apps option. And that shows you all of our system apps as well. So we're gonna go through this list of apps until you find the Google Play services application. And you can even do a search for this app at the top here, but only after the show system apps option has been enabled. Once you find Google Play services, tap on into it. And then again, look toward the top, tap on that three dot menu icon and uninstall all of the updates. You will be asked to confirm if that's what you want to do. Tap on okay. And look for that toast message at the bottom telling you that the updates have been uninstalled. From what I've read, you will probably be asked to log back into your Google account, so be aware of that. But that seems like a small price to pay to actually get your daily driver smartphone and your brand new Google Pixel 10 working as it should. I would like to start a new community questions video here on the channel. So, if you're having trouble with your Android smartphone or tablet, or maybe you just have a question about Android in general, then send in an email to questions at explainingandroid.com. Thankfully, we're not seeing this issue happening with any other Google Pixel phones, but it does go to show just how easy it can be to let something like this slip through the cracks especially when it only affects a small segment 
of your user base. If you're seeing this issue on your phone, please let us know about it in the comment section below as I don't have this device yet, so I'm not exactly sure how widespread this issue is. But it is nice that we have a workaround to use while it's getting fixed in Mountain View. Please remember to share this video with others who also own a Pixel 10 and click on that like button too so YouTube knows to share it with as many people as possible. And I would like to thank everyone who has become a member of this channel. I am truly honored that we're about to pass the 20 member milestone, something that I never thought was possible when I first launched it. And I'll be sure to include a link in the video description below as well as the pinned comment so that everyone else can join and be a member of the channel as well.